This morning we're celebrating Mardi Gras and Fat Tuesday. Fat Tuesday is the day leading up to the beginning of Lent on Ash Wednesday. That's right. Fat Tuesday is a day to indulge before giving up things for Lent. And one popular treat <clears throat> is, of course, the punch key. Gets you all worked up, Pete, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> day breaks <clears throat> Alexandra Rios Mobia is live at Missouri's Bakery in the Old First Ward. Good morning, Alex. Hey, good morning, Melissa and Pete. Over here at Missouri Bakery, they've been oh, operating since 1933, which means they've been in business for 90 years this year. And we are here joined with Marga. She is with the bakery as well as OLV Human Services. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for coming. Yeah, thank you. And today is a very special day, not only because it's Fat Tuesday, but here in Western New York, we know this day for something else, um, which is right here on your shirt, Punch Key Day. Um, could you tell us about this day and how are you guys preparing for it? Sure, absolutely. So um, we love a tradition at Missouri, so we make our traditional punch key down here, which is an enriched dough. Um, back in Poland, people were trying to get rid of all of their extra fats and sugars before the Lenten season, so they would make these um, delicious donuts. We fill ours with a black raspberry jam and then we glaze them with a rum glaze. Yeah, and I just had one 30 minutes ago, very delicious, but what else do you guys sell here? Uh, what are some other popular treats that you guys offer here at the bakery? Sure, so I think we're most well known for our rye bread, um, but we also make these stolens, which are very long pastries, similar to like an almond ring, but it's in a log shape. We have those in all different uh, flavors. Um, I would say our pastry hearts are always a fan favorite as well. Perfect, and beyond the bakery, you guys also do some really cool things, some vocational training. Could you tell me a little bit about what goes into that and why I even do that in the first place. Absolutely. So all of Human Services purchased the bakery back in June of 2020, kind of as a way that we could use a business in the community to teach our kids different vocational skills. So we're going to have some students down here this morning. Um, we've been here since 10 p.m. last night, but the kids, they get to come in a little bit later. But they're going to help us glaze and fill your donuts, box your donuts. You'll probably have some of them cashing you out if you come in to pick up an order. Perfect. And you guys can experience all of this today. They are open at 7 a.m. right here at South Park Avenue in Buffalo. You can come out and try one of these treats yourself. Um, I know I had mine a couple minutes ago and it was very good. So you guys come out and try it. Melissa and Pete, I'm going to send it back to you guys. After eating a punch, you probably need a nap. They're so heavy, but they are delicious. <laughs> Alex, thanks. And that rye bread is no joke. Mm -hmm. Well, we are just one day away from the start of Lent. That means fish fry season and our annual fish fry map is back. If you're looking for a Fish Fry Friday over the next few weeks, be sure to check out our original Fish Fry map at WGRZ.com. You can find it right there under the Featured section. If you don't see a favorite spot on the map, guess what? You can add it. Just click the Submit a Fish Fry Event button to add your favorite.